And one, lo one local church pinked it up today in honor of Breast Cancer Awareness Month. WVUA 23's Priscilla Strada has more. Jabari, it was all about pink at the New Prospect Missionary Baptist Church. I spoke with one breast cancer survivor who shared her journey of overcoming the disease. I was just really in disbelief. I did not believe that it was actually happening to me. A mother of two, a wife and friend, Angela Hunter was diagnosed with breast cancer in September of 2014 at the age of 36. For me, it was... I just, my hand just kind of grazed across it and I felt it, but I knew it was something abnormal. When I caught mine, I was at stage three and I had still done everything that I thought I was supposed to do. After surgery to remove the cancerous mass and rounds of chemotherapy, Angela is now cancer free and happy to still be here. I am extremely happy to still be here today um, to, I mean, I take the good with the bad now. It's like everything is just in a whole different light. Like my son's school called the other day and it's like, oh, but it's like, oh, I'm here to take that phone call. You know, I'm here to discipline him and tell him, hey, this is the right way to go. The church wanted a survivor like Hunter to speak about her journey and know that through awareness and support, it's all possible to overcome. We have members here that have had breast cancer, and then me personally, uh, this church family supported me with the loss of my grandmother who had breast cancer, and we just, just really wanted to amp it up about awareness and, you know, just basically the, the self-exam and making people understand that we all can be affected. It's not that it's somebody away from here. It can be me, you, or anybody else. So that kind of is the reason why we started that. Doctors do advise an annual mammogram examination in order for early detection. DCH Hospital is holding free mammogram exams for the Latina community tomorrow afternoon with an appointment. Reporting tonight, I'm Priscilla Strada, WVUA 23 News.